Hello, Automation Enthusiasts. Welcome back to KT Sessions, your go-to channel for all things automation. I'm Bharat, and today we have an exciting topic lined up for you, VB Script in Automation Anywhere A360. The VB Script package contains actions that enable VB Script functions in a task. 1. Verify that the device on which you want to run the VB script has Windows operating system installed. 2. Open a VB script file or input the script you want to run using the open action. You must associate the details of the file or script you want to run with a session name. Use this same session name for other VB script actions. 3. Dot use the run function action to execute a function within the script or execute the entire script. You must use the VB script session name you established in the previous step. 4. After you have executed the script, close the VB script session. To review the bot launcher logs, navigate to C backslash program data backslash automation anywhere backslash bot runner backslash logs backslash current month backslash bot underscore launcher today's date dot log dot zip. Each zipped folder contains a file with data on the code execution, which is useful for debugging. There are three actions in the VB script package. Close, open and run function. So, Let's see how can we use it in control room. Take all three actions of VBS script package. Open action in VB script. This action enables you to open a VB script file. Opens a VB script file. In the VB script session field, specify a session name. Use this same session name for other VB script actions. In the VB script, Choose one of the following options. In the Import Existing File option, select an existing VB script file. In the Manual Input option, enter the VB script. Note, if you are uploading a script from a file on your desktop, the file and any dependencies must be in a standalone folder. When you select a file for upload, all files and folders at the same folder level are uploaded. Run function action in VB script. We can run a function within VB script using the run function action. In the VB script session field, specify a session name. Use the same session name from the open action in VB script. Optional, specify the function name to run and the arguments to pass to the function. Optional, if the specified function returns a value, Specify the variable to store that value in the assign the output to variable field. The control room shows a descriptive default variable name. If you create several output variables, subsequent variable names are appended with a minus 1, minus 2, minus 3, and so on to avoid duplication. Note, you can pass only a list variable as an argument for the function. You can use the list variable to pass multiple arguments of different data types such as boolean, date time, number, and string. Note, in VB script, stand alone scripts do not return a value. Close action in VB script. This action enables you to close the session in VB script. Specify the same session name from the open action in VB script. Let's run the bot and we can see a message box from VB script. Now go back to the script and create a function. In run action, give the name of function. Let's run the bot. We can see a message box from VB script. Now go back to the script and create an input parameter in function. I v assigned input value to a variable using string assign. In run action, pass an input parameter. Let's run the bot.
we can see a message box from VB script. Now go back to the script and I've written a function which will accept and return a string. IV assigned input value to a variable using string assign. In run action, pass an input and output parameter. Let's run the bot and we can see a message box. Now create a notepad file and save it with .vbs extension and write vb's code in it. Now save it and import it in R. This is how we can use the VB script in our R task bot. Thank you for diving into the world of VB script in automation anywhere a 360 with us. Globe with Meridian's sparkles, we hope this journey has empowered you with valuable insights and skills to supercharge your automation game. Thumbs up sign if you found this video helpful. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. Bell stay tuned for more in-depth tutorials, tips, and tricks on automation anywhere and other exciting technologies. Handshake Let's build a community of automation enthusiasts. Share your thoughts, questions, and experiences in the comments below. Speaking head in silhouette your feedback fuels our passion for creating quality content. Glowing Star connect with us on social media for updates, behind the scenes, and exclusive content. Mobile phone busts in silhouette we appreciate your support and together let's elevate our automation skills to new heights. Person with folded hands, thank you for being part of our learning journey. Until next time, happy automating. Rocket Sparkles